Welcome back. Crowdsourcing continues to generate millions of dollars for projects all over the world. And as Andy Choi found, one man's twist on raising money could tap into a lifetime of business. Yeah, we got this. It's a step in a new direction for this century-old building. It's been a bar for more than a hundred years, with every owner believing the adage, if you serve it, they will drink. I would say offer what you would want to be offered. I've always wanted to own a dive bar. Jeff Cornelius, the building's newest owner, is now weeks away from the grand opening of Globe Hall on the north side of Denver. This building has this magic to it. The walls are original, the skylight's original, the stage is original. Jeff hopes a little live music and barbecue bring out the crowds. And for those willing to make an investment up front, there's this. Well, it's a pretty good deal, I think, if you're, if you're going to be in Denver for a while. Um, you do get uh, beer for life. Hold the phone. Beer for life? You can come here as many nights as we are open. Limit is two beers because we want everybody to go home safely. Yes, 500 bucks will get you beer for life, a golden opportunity for Jeff to raise money while potential investors raise a glass. Cheers, guys. So how much beer is beer for life? I live right right here. I mean, and I like beer. Exactly. Yeah, sure. Every time you go for 500 bucks, uh, lifetime. Sales. So we did the math, and if you had your two free beers once a week at the bar, you'd have your investment paid off in less than two years. You know, I don't think it's about the beer, all about the beer. David Spector is one of the 40 Beer for Life investors who says the idea isn't just about kicking back a few brews. This is sort of what crowdfunding was intended to be, a group of people coming around a concept. That's a sense of community that I really want to belong to. And we plan to be in the neighborhood for, you know, the next 20 or 30 years. So these are long-term relationships I'm hoping to build. So in this era of Kickstarter and GoFundMe, Go Beer Me looks to be a toastworthy proposition, a glass half full endeavor hopping with pints of opportunity. For the now, I'm Andy Choi. It's about the beer. Now, the goal for Globe Hall is to have 200 Beer for Life investors. Jeff says he got the idea from a bar in Minneapolis that made a similar offer before its grand opening. Not a bad business plan. And right now, that's about it for us here on The Now. We'll see you tomorrow back here at 4. Stick around. 7 News at 5 starts right now.